Can you remember your very first job? I mean, the first job you've ever had in your life. You got hired to do a job. He goes, I got hired. I got a job. And how exciting it was. And your boss talking to you and saying, hey, you're hired. And this is what I want you to do. These are the, your responsibilities. That first job you had, you had these responsibilities. And, you know, really wanting to prove yourself. And at the end of the week getting paid and saying, hey, you know, hey, I earned my oats. I really put an effort in here. I feel good about it. The first job for you. Could you remember that? Could you remember what your boss was like? And over the course of your life, have you remembered several different jobs? It's like, oh, yeah, I remember this job. I remember that job. Could you remember a job that you had in the course of your life that was your very, yeah, it was like, the, it was the best job. It was like, oh, my gosh, it was so awesome working for this company. The, the boss was absolutely great. It, it was the greatest boss I've ever had. I mean, they were so good. The company that I worked for, like a company that maybe they actually had like a mission statement and they made it clear, this is what our mission is. You have a job like that ever? That was like, wow, that was the best company to work for. My boss was just so outstanding. What happens sometimes over the course of time, you know, when you're at a job like that, there's this, this sort of routine that you fall into. Just like, you know, you get up in the morning, you might drive to work and you follow the same road. For me... I, I go to the same supermarket. I go to the same supermarket every week. And, and a few weeks ago, there was a, a small fire in the supermarket. So I was like, it's closed. They're closed. They have to remodel. They have to fix it. They have to uh, take care of everything. So I was forced to go to a different supermarket. You get in this routine. And maybe you get into a routine at work. Then it's almost like it's you're on automatic pilot. You're not even realizing what you're doing. Just like you follow the same road to work or to the supermarket or to the post office you just go on the same road and you get to work it's like oh I didn't, I didn't even realize how i got here i just did it without even thinking without even thinking you just kind of automatic pilot well, let me get back to that that boss that boss that you had that was the best boss you ever had and how outstanding that was like oh what a great boss i had you realize that our mind is the boss. Our mind is the boss. Our body, our physical body, is the worker. And sometimes the worker is just on automatic pilot. It's just following the same road, following the routine without even really thinking. It's just like, oh, I just go the same way, I do the same things. But our mind, our brain, is the CEO of our life. It's the boss. It controls what we do or think. It's like, I, I'm not going to move. My physical body's not going to move unless my brain sends a signal. Move your arms and legs. Start walking. But it's on automatic pilot, so I just start walking without too, too much thought because it's on automatic pilot. Now, follow me here for a minute. You have the opportunity. Like, if you had the opportunity to work for a great company that had a clear mission statement, it's like, this is what our company is about. And... The best boss you've ever had, it's like this, the greatest boss I've ever had. They're just so encouraging. They're so, they know exactly what to do. They explain it clearly. That is you. That is right here. So do not let it just go on automatic pilot. Listen to your brain. Listen to the boss. Say, hey, what am I supposed to do next? What, you know, what are, the, what is a clear mission statement for this? Too often, we just take actions without thinking. For the month of June, just think about it. This is, you know, I'm the CEO. I'm the boss. I'm the greatest boss that I've ever had. Very clear. Know exactly what the company is about. Know what the mission is. And the physical body is the employee the following up the order. Hey, my boss told me I got to start you know, taking better care of my health, eating right, exercising, making sure I'm getting a proper sleep. The truck just went by, that was a little distraction. But listen, the boss is being clear to you. Don't let the body just go on automatic pilot and just mindlessly do whatever it wants. Like, no, I'm taking control. The CEO, the boss is telling me, and then the body's follow, follow through, follow through. So before you do things for this month, Think about it. Think about it. this is what I, my my mission is. This is what my goal is. I have the best boss. 
that cares about the company, knows clearly what the mission statement is, and I'm going to follow through and put, put my best effort on it. So at the end of the, when I get my paycheck, I'll be like, wow, this is rewarding. I earned my oats on this. And that's the possibility. That is what you could pull off for yourself. The best, the best of the best that you could do is all within your power. I mean, you are the CEO. You are the boss of your life. You're, you're in control of it. But don't just let things happen the way they happen. Stop. Think, okay, what is the thing I'm supposed to specifically be doing to today? Am I eating right? Am I exercising? Send that message to your body. It's like, what I'm picking up? Is this employee following orders? Am I, am I feeding myself the right stuff? Am I putting in the effort? You could take great pride into the effort that you put into it. It's like, hey, you got a great boss. They know exactly what the mission is. They know what they're doing. Follow the orders. Don't let the body just go on automatic pilot. Be a good employee. You are in charge. I hope that you follow through with this. This is a Monday morning. It's a brand new week, a brand new month. And it's all within your power. I want to thank you for being part of this Facebook group. Anybody that's on this Facebook group, thank you for being part of this Facebook group. For the month of June, anybody that's on this group, I'm throwing out the invitation to give me a direct message. I'll share a link to set up a time. And tell me what is your mission statement? What is your goals for the month of June? What are you going to accomplish? This is your business. This is your life. You just got hired by the best company in the world with the best boss in the world. Is your employee going to follow through and do what they're supposed to do? <laughs> it's all up to you. I'd love to hear what your goals, what your mission is for the month of June. Have a great day. Make sure you put the effort in. Let's see how you could take that goal or dream and turn it into a reality for the month of June. Have a great day.